Okay, since the last time that we had done a recording of the Bear Fist fight, we had taken a break to go ahead and power level our character a little bit. So here we are now. First and foremost, you can see with the armor set that I've got here, I've gone ahead and, as courtesy of my uh, desires to get some more souls, I sped run through the... Um, Ashes of Ariandel DLC, bypassing most of the enemies, getting to a Wilhelm fight, and was graciously blessed with Wilhelm suiciding off a cliff. So, pretty easy fight there. Um, I've, I didn't do the boss fight because if I did decide to do that for this character run, I did want to have that recorded. The Wilhelm fight wasn't an intended. I was actually more, I'm curious what'll happen. So, yes, we are wearing the Wilhelm armor set, which you can see right here. Now, why are we wearing Wilhelms as opposed to Fallen Knight, which is technically lighter? Well, it's got a little bit more dark resistance. It suffers a little bit compared to fire resistance. As you can see there, you know, we could increase our fire by several points, but I also, I'm trying to find a balance between fire and dark, because those are the two element types, I believe, unless the other one's magic, but I think it's, or at least I want to think it's dark, so I'm using the Wilhelm set to overcome that. I could be wrong, but also, in my opinion, this is a really cool looking set for a boxing type character. You get the cool cloth flow. So. And I just all around like it a lot better. So back here, I'm... Well, I've got this going. We don't actually need that. Um, with the Wilhelm set though, I'm trying to do more damage mitigation. Flynn's ring is going to now do us no good. I could take the Karthus Milk Ring, which would give me an extra one point of damage. That's better than nothing. Because even if I take this, I'm not going to drop substantially into the next category, or at least into another category for some fast rolls. So. Plus, I gain a little bit more defense. So, we'll do that. Don't necessarily need the souls, although the souls are great. Um, we do need stamina recovery, like I said here. This is just giving me with that ring we picked up earlier. Um, damage absorption across the board. So you can see here we've got minimum. Lightning doesn't matter for this fight, but minimum for the other is 23 on magic, just in case it's magic. Um, if it's dark, we got 26. Fire, though, his primary thing that hits us, we have amped up to 37, courtesy of the flame stone blade ring. I also picked that up off camera. So, we are still running with no weapons equipped. Um, flipping back over to player status, you can see my character level here. I've amped it up. Um, with the milk ring, it actually gives us three dexterity levels. So that actually went from 40 to 43, because um, otherwise it's actually 40-40, and I'll showcase that there. You can see it's 40-40. Uh, we have, I've raised my HP, let me put that back on, I've raised my HP to 34, I normally stop at 27. The reason we did that is, as you can see in the center there, my HP is at 1125. I want to try and take that HP eventually, I apologize if there's any background noise that's getting picked up. We're film uh, recording in a different locale than normal, so apologies if you're getting interference in the background. But as back to what we were saying, I'm trying to get the HP up to a minimum of 1300, um, solely because when we are unembered we're sitting on 1300 HP. Um, I have not touched stamina yet. 
Um, it's still at its base endurance of 12. That needs to go up to 24 for me to be comfortable. Um, but I also don't want to sit here for now. I don't mind farming more level ups to get us back into our comfort zone. But I also know that if it takes another solid day, because I'm farming about one level up every 20 minutes, 30 minutes, something like that. And I need to do 12 of those. That's like six hours of play. So I'd rather get it more naturally as we progress through the game world. As opposed to doing a loop, murdering the same enemies over and over again. Don't get me wrong. That has its own level of fun. Um, I do... I am comfortable with the monotony. So with that long explanation over, and only due to the fact that we took a long cut... Um, let's go ahead and progress. Like we mentioned, we've already cleared out everything prior to Pontiff Sullivan. We just didn't have time to do a cut against him. That's the only downside with this guy. Having such. Oh, I must have aggroed the second one. Yep, we aggroed the second one. Ah. Isn't that friendly? You know what? I gained nothing from that. Let's just advance. Somewhere over there. Let's see if I can get a backstab on this guy, though, for him here. Where are you? I wish they had. Aha! Okay. Now, guy down here. Is proceeding back up. He can easily kill me. Because he runs a pretty tight system. So. enough this time. Oh, we've got an Estus back. That's really going to come in handy. So I'm going to go ahead and number up. And as we can see now, our HP went from what it normally would be unembered, or sorry, embered with 27 in vigor. We would only have 1300. Now we have 1462. I do want to try and amp that up because with a punchy character, I can't rely on other mechanics like bleed or, you know, frostbite to kick in. I just gotta sit there and pummel them in the face. So I'm gonna take, let's see, that's Lundor Pale Shade, Swordsman. I'll take my buddy Gothard here. Just because I'm really wanting a distraction for the double fight, if he can get that far. I've only ever... I've predominantly only run one character at a time. I've not done two. So I have no idea what that would do. Probably make my damage non-existent. So, come on through, please. 
Okay. So. Hopefully. Ninety-eight damage. Got hard to die. Sweet, fan of that. Okay, well, so now instead of <laughs> having a distraction, we've now made phase two harder. Definitely feel the lack of reach on this fight. Ow. Aha, uh -huh, dodge. That's my bad. Okay. I got a feeling that I should just homer bone out and save the ember. because I'm running low on S's. Eh, let's go ahead and do that. No need to waste. That does mean that I'm going to risk my greatest advantage that I had being unnumbered at the beginning was a free reset to full health. So I'm a little curious how I'm going to overcome that. Maybe these guys won't follow me. Highly unlikely. Nope, they're definitely following. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe he's going to help. Looks like he's headed back down. Okay, I need to kill this guy soon though. Otherwise, sight dudes can show up. Wow! Bad dodges are bad. Oh, really? I want to summon Waifu, because I didn't know that was an option. Hopefully that doesn't ruin the...
Pay me no mind. Nope. Good enough. Cool. I didn't realize Henri was summonable for this. That's nice. Alright, let's try that. Wait for Henri to come through. Okay. Stop hurting, Henri. Just saying. Ah. Good job, Henry. Please don't die, though. Because I don't do significant damage against him. Yeah, you do that some. Alright. Nobody said. With the power of waifu love. So we'll be seeing Henri a little bit later. Go get married in our creepy marriage ceremony. I was pleasantly surprised. I'd never actually done Henri's quest line with the... <coughs> Sorry, the side where you actually use her to fight. That was kind of cool. I don't think you get any rings or gear that we could use. My system is lagging a little. Ah, uh -huh. uh, yep, two swords. <clears throat> okay. So. It's gonna be worth 12. I only need 15 to level. Bum -ba -da -ba. Oh, yeah. By the way, right here, I've been keeping up with the cases, keeping it powered and upgraded as I uh, progress. Just in case, like, I know I've said the whole time I've been doing this character. 
I'm really on the fence as it were just because I really don't know I don't know if I'm gonna be like no we need it right now where I stand I don't know I mean we were able to overcome Sullivan which is generally what I would deem the hurdle you know is a build gonna do it is my player skill good enough yes we used an NPC to fight but still a valid you know clearing tactic so I don't know I still don't know I will say it would have given us an extra hundred something bonus attack so that would have been nice all right each time I've I've been leveling up HP past my, you know, 27 that I normally go. Each time I do it, it's like, ah, that's so many souls. I would so much rather be leveling endurance. But well, I one. it's less common for me to go, man, I just wish I had some more uh, stamina as opposed to, my goodness, I need more HP. Like, the difference uh, actually showed itself on the Sullivan fight. <clears throat> Sorry. We were able to sit there and tank through. Yes, we're wearing heavier armor. But at the same, at the same time, we also didn't have to sit there and watch our HP nearly as closely. We had bonus HP to rely on. So... I kind of like it, and I kind of hate it at the same time. Get him! I don't know why, but get him! No! Ah! Die! I'm doing it for the souls. So the other one's also a Twinkling Titanite, but... None of my gear is Twinkling Titanite related. Maybe if I upgrade the Shield of Want. But. I don't know. I'd have to watch the whole run through again. I'll probably do that. But I don't think I've actually equipped a shield. Maybe I have. Let's go get this ring over here. This is the dark stone plate ring. Oh, hey, character summon. Dugrad Venoxia. Very cool name. So, always been curious which one they can see. So I won't be able to go that way. Get the shortcut. Go pick up the cells. Ah. No, it's not souls at all. Okay. It looks like my controller has died. Awesome. <laughs> guy's like, what on earth is going on? So, well, he'll get a free kill. Sorry about that, Dunegrad. If there were a way for me to... Really surprised. I thought I had it plugged in last night. <sighs> hmm. Make sure it's plugged into a power source. It is. It's pushed in all the way, in fact. Am I going to have to keyboard and mouse it? Oh boy. Okay, that's... Oh sweet, now I've got the, also the character glitch of... <laughs> having been walking a certain direction. Yes. So I can only hope and pray that my... 
controller is going to charge here soon. We're going to accept this now as a new parameter of the challenge run. Okay, right click it is. Because I can't... My character now refuses to accept left click. Which I thought was another form of attack. But that's okay. Oh boy. Okay, spacebar's roll. That's going to be very important here. I'm going to have to. Sweet, that's E. Okay. Please, oh, please start charging. But if this becomes too unbearable. <laughs> this is hilarious. Oh, I guess my souls really didn't matter. Boy, howdy. I don't know. I don't know what sprint is, so we can't rely on that. I'm about to have to do some platforming with my character veering to the left. So, this will be fun. Ugh. Okay, so far so good. Ay ay ay, here comes the worst. <laughs> you can do it! <laughs> no you can't! <laughs> okay. It does seem odd. Normally my controller lights up when charging. Maybe the brick is bad. Let me try a different brick. Sorry, character's gonna walk a little again. It's weird. I think the cable's bad. Maybe the cable's bad. Maybe something's bad. I thought I brought the normal cable I charge with. Hmm. And again, maybe I didn't. Let's plug it. Where's the plug? It at least recognized that something was plugged in. So, hmm. I don't know. It's weird. I wish there were a way to reset the inputs. I mean, I would totally do keyboard and mouse. Oh, is that... Aha! We found how to chug an Estus. Just confirm. Yep. Good. So that's R. So that's center camera. I don't know what that is. What's F? F is nothing. E is pick up space. I don't know what dash is. Because that'd be handy right now, too. Well, yes, I did serpentine. <laughs> Believe you me, it is not out of um, personal desires right now. There's actually a way to repeat this. This would be a hilarious challenge run. Character always veering to us with the left or something. Oh, 
Navajo ledge. Ah, uh, can't sprint past the night. <laughs> He didn't follow me. I'm gonna just auto run into this corner for a second. <sighs> Got another ember. <sighs> oh, that's not the right button at all. Trying to find what kind of button would make sense for a dash. Just got your W E A S D. successfully made it to Anne Orlando. And we even lit the bonfire. We're gonna rest. Rest at the bonfire. Okay. Wow, that is some pretty pretty fantastic technical failures. So I'm a little uncertain why the controller is no longer charging. But I'm thinking the best course of action at this point is to do a cut. I don't necessarily want to. I'd love to keep playing. But I can't actually get the controller to come on. My character is veering to the left. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and just cut it here. I'd love to wave farewell like I normally do. To be frank, I don't even know how to select that. It would look all jaggedy. So we're just going to go ahead and say farewell for now. Apologies for the technical failure on my part. We'll try and see if we can get them resolved and start another shoot here soon. For now, take care.